Hello everybody and welcome back to Foundation. My name is of course Constantine and in the previous episode we managed to build up this beautiful church here on the left side. Uh, which I'm really loving the look of it. Now before we do anything, I think that we have some issues with it. Uh, because I see that my people are not going inside anymore. So let's try to remove some of these things right here. Hopefully uh, my people are going to be able... Oh look at that, they were glitched inside it. I knew it. God dang it. Why the heck did that happen? Because I see that now they are going inside. And um, all these errors here are not gonna show up anymore. There we go. So this is definitely the error that we have with the church. I saw that error while, was, while I was editing the episodes and I knew that there was something wrong with uh, the church entrance here and that I had to fix it somehow. But now that it's functioning, uh, let's keep up with the journey. So what I gotta do now is figure out a way to make more money. Um, let's see, at the moment we do not have- oh, a new military mission is available. What? New mission. Hmm, my lord, things are boiling up between the realm and our evil neighbors. I personally don't know what it's all about the king is requesting your help. Of course, you will be rewarded according to your war effort. Your head my might be with uncertainties, so better be prepared. Oh, look at that, 100% chance of gold. Yeah, let's go with this, I don't know. I don't know if I have uh, what I need, but I think that we actually need some people in here in order to do this uh, this battle. So let's assign some soldiers. So currently we have two soldiers. Open military manager. Army. Strength. Oh. Apparently I can give my soldiers some swords. Although they are untrained, <laughs> they may need to go inside here and start training. Look at that. That is awesome. We're getting soldiers here. Although, I think we got two female soldiers. <laughs> and one male. That is weird. I don't know what this guy is doing, but whatever. Uh, so we do have this mission here. Let me think about it. My soldiers only serve me. Yeah, let's go with that. Accept mission list. So we can definitely assign some soldiers in here. Interesting. I could send... Yeah, let's just send these guys. Hopefully they can do good. Because the uh, success rate there was extreme, so I think that we got this. Uh, once we get some more people, I may just assign some more. But uh, for now, we should be all good. Uh, let's see, view mission, battle history... Alright, we are definitely done with this one. I am gonna try this one as... Of, after that, but the problem is this one is extremely difficult. So I may not be able to do this one instead. I should have not accepted this one. But um, anyway, hopefully we're gonna be good. Alright, anyway, uh, what else? Now I saw that people are not gonna chop trees if uh, this stone cutter camp is not close enough. Actually, hold up, hold up, what am I saying here? Uh, so these two are assigned to be collected. Uh, what about this thing? We got one dude here, which I'm gonna unassign and assign this dude right here instead. So that he can start chopping up some rock. I'm also gonna start adding... Actually, I'm gonna leave this as is. I really like this. I really, really like this. So let's just remove this thing here. I don't want them to chop trees in there anymore. Um, for station. Let's remove this as well. We definitely do not need that. Uh, my people are also chopping trees here, which is great. They're planting, they're chopping, they're doing their stuff. Let's also add this for extraction, maybe? Nah, never mind. I don't, I don't want that. Uh, what should I do here? Let's see. So the problem is, I need to add some people in here, actually. These guys are actually already chopping trees, so they are doing their job. Extraction, let's select all this area for extraction, why not? Just like that, deselect this area. Just like that, leave those trees alone, I don't want them to chop down these trees. And I think these trees are way too far away for that camp. So let's remove that as well. Um... Okay, so I see that they removed the trees in here, which I selected, which is really great. 
Let's also remove the selection. I need them to leave these trees here because I really like them. I don't really want to remove all the trees everywhere. Uh, let's also remove this. Delete. Let's also remove this. And now that we have some more people, let's add one forager there. Uh, we got this going. We got this going. Can we add some people here? There we go. That is great. That is great. And I think we're actually doing pretty well. We're definitely doing much, much better than we did before. Once I get enough money, I think I'm going to grab myself another area because um, we are in desperate need of more spacing. And look at this. This thing is still doing its stuff. Uh, we do need to assign a priest in here, though. Uh, let's see. Priest. None. How do you assign a priest, though? Status promotion. Hmm. Can we promote some soldiers, maybe? Forgers, transporters, forgers, builders. Stone cutters. Yeah, I think I'm not going to promote anybody. I'm going to leave it as is. Uh, we are in need of money. Uh, what else? Let's look in the trading menu here for a second. So we got these three activated. Uh, we are selling berries, but I'm going to go with 20 here. Let's make more money. Let's go with 40 wood. Uh, let's go with... Actually, let's leave the planks as they are. Actually, no, you know what? We have a lot of planks. Let's go with 50 planks. Let's go with 30 stone, maybe. Uh, these things we are buying constantly. Uh, let's start selling some more cloth as well. Maybe like 30. For the rocks, we have a lot of rocks. Let's sell 70 rocks. Alright, fishies, we are selling fishies. Uh, let's go with 100 clothing, since we're not selling the clothing in the market. Let's just sell the crap on this clothing. Alright, hopefully that's going to bring some more money in. Uh, what else? What else do we can we do here? Let's see if we can build up some more stuff. So, we have a forest in camp. A uh, bakery. So, how are the bakeries going? This one has two workers, which is great. Uh, this one can have another worker as well. So, let's add that. Uh, we have people working in here as well. We have people working here. Ooh, my lords! Your troops have been very helpful regarding the matter with our evil neighbors. They said... The matter seems far from being resolved yet, and we will still need your support. Keep my troops with you. Oh yeah, keep my troops with you, whatever. Do your thing. We got this, we don't need them so far. Uh, these things are definitely gonna keep on collecting stuff, which is great. We have workers working on that. We got workers working on that as well. Uh, people are producing flowering here as well, which is great. Alright, that is perfect. I think I may need to build up a stone camping here. Hopefully this will uh, resolve this and give me some iron or something like that. Uh, also, I may need to put a stone mason in here as well. I'm not quite sure. A wheat farm, windmill. Yeah, I think I may need to put a stone mason in here as well. So let's just do that. Hopefully we can get rid of this. Uh, to -do, do What else? We got a market, rustic church, wooden bridge, wooden keep, and the Lord Manor, which we already have. Uh, I wish I could add some more soldier in here, but in the meantime, select functions. Oh, this is the dorms, and this is going to be the treasury, so let's go with that. We've set up two of these things to be what I need. Uh, and Great Hall. Alright, edits. Can we add some more stuff to this? I don't know. Extensions. I mean, I could maybe add some flags just to beautify the area. So let's just do that. Why not? Add some flags in. Let's make this place beautiful. Um... Let's rotate this one like that. 
Perfect. I may also need to add in some walls. Edges, large stone wall, and wooden wall. Let's go with the wooden wall around this thing. So let's get this going like this. All the way up to here. Um, I may just need to include this as well inside it. Why not? This, like this. In here, I may need to put a portal. Or not a portal. <laughs> uh, like a gate, I guess. A wooden gate. Just like this one. And hopefully plop it in here somehow. Make sure it looks good. And I think... I think this looks perfect. Look at that. That is great. So this is a little bit uh, better protected, I guess. This is like our military base. So this should be good. Alright, let's see. Stone Mason Hut, Stone Cutter Camp. Um, so I think these two are... Actually, we need the guy to work in here. Oh, never mind. We do have three carpenters working here, which is great. And we do have three cho wood choppers right in here. Which is also really great. I'm gonna have them um, chop up those trees over there as well. Hopefully they can. Hopefully they can manage that. Uh, we also need some people to start chopping this up. So let's see. Alright, we got two females in here. Hopefully they get rid of this. Ah, crap. Those soldiers were victorious. And they actually brought in a lot of gold and bread. And iron, polished stone and tools. Wow. Alright, well, you know what? Since we got ourselves some money and we can now buy some land, let's just do that. Let's expand this area a little bit. So, I could definitely expand here, but this will only allow me to grab this forest. Which, I'm not quite sure if I want to do that. Instead, what I want to do is... Maybe expand this way. So, let's grab this one and this one. That is perfect. Look at that. We just got ourselves two more lands. Which will hopefully allow me to get some more people moving in. I definitely want to do that. Um, so in order to do that, let's first of all extend this for residential. Hopefully my people want to join. So let's go with residential all the way to here. And um, let's see if they will decide to go inside these areas that I'm marking down here. I'm really hoping that my people are going to want to move inside these areas. I don't know. Whoever wants to move in, it's going to be welcome. I'm just going to mark down as much area as, as I can so that they can go in these areas. Hopefully. I don't know. I do not know. Um, so we're definitely getting more people deciding to join in. That is great. And what I might just end up doing is creating a market, some more markets, um, I just don't know where, maybe here? Since we have some uh, residential area here. So let's just go ahead and do that real fast. Uh, market. So let's get ourselves another market going. Alright, so I want my people to be able to purchase some stuff from right over here. So we got one for fishies. Uh, one for berries. And I guess I could put another one for bread. Just like that. Add in some more of these things. Beautify the area. Uh, assign this as a food stall. Perfect. Now let's also add in some benches. Let's see... I could definitely put in some benches on benches on this side, but I don't want to block off houses from spawning in. So let's just put two sets of benches right here. Add a set of barrels right here. Some more benches on the back. Just like that, why not? Alright, that is perfect. And also, let's add in some fences. So I think I'm gonna put a fence right in there. Hopefully all these thingies that I'm adding right now, they're beautifying the, they're beautifying the area and they might just convince people to start moving in. So let's start construction on that. Uh, let's also add some bushes around, of course. 
make this area even better. Convince more people to move around. Some more bushes here. Wooden gate, fences. Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it as is for now. And see uh, how this will evolve. Assign someone here to work. Also assign someone here to work. Perfect. Uh, let's also put in some fishies in here. And, I don't know, flower, maybe? Whatever. We cannot add any more people in there, unfortunately. Alright, we should be good. Hopefully more people will start uh, moving in there. Uh, let's see, what else? I don't know what to say about this one. This one seems to be blocking my people in. Let's just sell this. There we go. Hopefully that got them unstuck. And I might not just build this stuff in here anymore. Let's just get my people to work in here instead. Yeah, they already moved in. That is perfect. Alright, so that's gonna provide more materials. Uh, these guys are already having a, an area where they can chop the trees. Um, let's see, how is this going? So nobody wants to join. Nobody wants to go and move in these areas. I don't know why, though. I really, really wish people would start moving in those areas so that we can get more people joining in. But uh, anyway, so let's see. What can we build? Actually, can we unlock some more stuff so that we can start building us some more stuff? Um, so we cannot do anything here. This one is still locked. Yeah, we may need some more clergy points or kingdom points in order to start building up some more things. Hmm. And I would also really love to have some uh, tax offices so that we can get some more some taxes from more people. We definitely need to collect more money from them. Uh, wooden keep, wooden bridge, rustic church. I mean, at the moment, I really don't have an area we can put where we can place a wooden bridge. I think I'm gonna have to start looking into beautifying the area. And also locking down this area as well. So let's see. Oh, I think this is in the edges. That's why I'm not able to build here. Yeah. I may need this area in order to build up an, uh, a wall for here. Alright, never mind. I'm not gonna do that then. These guys are still producing fishies, which we're selling at an alarming rate, though. Oh, we don't have anybody here, though. So can we add someone? No, we don't have people in here. That is unfortunate. We definitely need to have some more citizens moving in our town. Um, I definitely have. I'm, I'm really loving this area right here. This area up here with the sheep, and that this is looking really gorgeous. I'm really enjoying this area. I think this is currently my favorite place. This area with the sheep and the church in the background. I mean, look at this. This is gorgeous. This is really good. All right, so we got the markets going. Uh, let's see. We definitely need some more people in here so that we can start selling stuff. Um, let's assign berries, fish, and bread. Alright, so we got these two going. The thing is, we need some more villagers so that we can assign some workers. Uh, which we currently do not have. Hmm. Oh, we got an audience here, let's see. Alright, so these guys need bread. Uh, let's give the bread to our people. Done! There we go! Hopefully this is gonna give us some more points on this side. Just don't know how many we have and how much we need. Actually, we have six at the moment. We need... 20? Oh no, we need, yeah, we need 20 points in order to unlock this area as well. Wow, we need quite a lot. So we have a lot, of, a lot more quests to get in order to start unlocking more, more stuff. But that's okay. That is actually really good. Um, actually, hold up. What is up with this one? Can we build this up? Like right here? 
Start construction. Uh, we cannot assign anybody here. What's up with my soldiers? Where are my soldiers at? Haven't they returned? Hmm. That is really weird. I know I had some soldier in here. Apparently, uh, we cannot see them anymore. Uh, let's see if we can assign a priest, though. Priests, none. I have no idea how you assign a priest in here. That is weird. Hmm. Yeah, that is really weird. I don't really see an option to assign a priest. Faithful attendance. I mean, of course nobody is attending since we don't have a priest in here. Um, what else? I could upgrade some people in here. I just don't want to spend too many points, so uh, that's enough promotions. That is enough. Yeah, I have no idea how to assign a priest in here. Where the crap am I gonna find myself a priest? Right, so these guys are collecting food. Uh, these guys are collecting... What else? Oh, look at that! Another house is building up. That is perfect. So we are getting more people joining in. Um... Yeah, I wish I could also erase a little bit of this area, the wooded area. I mean, I know that these houses started building up through the woods, which I would really love it if more of them would do that. Um, not sure if that's gonna happen, but anyway. Let's not assign anybody here, unfortunately. Alright, I'm also gonna have to... Actually, I already assigned someone here. I don't think that these guys are gonna be able to extract the uh, the stone from here or maybe they didn't finish no never mind they're just uh, building up that freaking flag and those two as well I guess okay so is this woman gonna come here and work yeah they're not going in there unfortunately to extract so uh, we need to get rid of this delete and delete we may need something else in order to extract this Alright, let's see. We got two hours here. I'm stuck by going to work. I don't know why I, where that is. Oh, in here. Are people getting stuck in this freaking thing? Or maybe not. I think they got it stuck. Okay, never mind. Never mind. So that's gonna work. Uh, people in here are already working. We can assign someone here as well. We got so many planks and stone and stuff in here, it's crazy. I don't want to rename my place, what the heck? Alright, there we go. Uh, oh, look at that, another house is being built right here. Awesome, I'm loving this. That is really great. I could also start assigning some more people here so that they can gra gather berries, why not? So let's just do that. Uh, gathering cuts right over here Just like that and Also a granary Yeah, why not let's put up a granary right here because this is this is very far away from the other areas and another gathering hut Maybe Right over here Um and also select this for frustration. There we go, that is perfect. And I'm gonna let this do its thing as well. What else? I mean, look at this house, I'm loving this. I love having houses like this through the woods. That is really great. That is really, really great. Uh, what else? I mean, I think I may need to start gathering some more stuff in this area. So I may need to build up another wheat farm around here. Maybe one here and one here. That may actually be really good. So before we do that, let's remove the residential area, area from this area. Right here, just like that. Perfect. And next up, let's build up a... Wheat farm. 
So, for this wheat farm, I'm definitely gonna place it right in here. And another wheat farm. Maybe right here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put it right in here. Before we start making the selection though, let's make sure we block off so that people do not walk through here anymore. Uh, so let's go with this, this. Uh, let's leave this outside the area, just like that. Make sure we have an entrance through here. Block that off. And also let's connect right in here. Just like that. That is perfect. Alright, so we got that going. Uh, let's also finish this up. Uh, I do not want that sheep to roam around here. So I hope she's gonna get out of there. Come on, you silly sheep. There you go. Alright, let's block this off just like that. Go through here because this whole area is gonna be wheat farm. And block that off. Perfect. Alright, um, let's see, what else? I mean, I... This one, I don't like it that it's facing this way, but that's okay. I see that my people are actually walking through here in order to go inside the, um, the wheel. Alright. Yeah, this is really great. I'm definitely gonna put two more farms in here, two more, two more wheat farms. Alright, what else? Let's see, what can we do next? You know what I want to do next? I want to forbid this land. I don't want people to walk through here anymore. So let's just block that off. I need them to stop walking through here. I don't like it when they're walking through this area. That is just frustrating. And also, let's mark this off for extraction. Actually, demark it, I guess I could say. Alright, perfect. That's gonna work. Uh, perfect. These farms are working. I mean, I don't understand why people are walking through here. Look at that. They just destroyed this area. This entire area is not usable anymore. Dang it. They really destroyed this. And I may just need to remove this entirely. Yeah, you know what? Let's just do that. Let's just... Uh, hold up, actually. I need to select this building here. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. What are you doing? Dang it. There we go. Remove this. Remove this area. That is perfect. All right. So they will not have to build through here anymore. Uh, what I'm going to do instead is mark this up. Just like that. Close that up. Paint crops. I need to go through here and through here. Also, remove this area. People are already walking through here, so this is not going to be useful anymore. Alright, that is perfect. Um, let's also remove the fence in here. Come on. What are you doing? I need you to remove the fence. There we go, and this one. Perfect. That is great. Alright, so now they can walk through here freely, freely without any... Uh, Without any issues. Uh, perfect. Let's see. What else? What do we have to do next? So this is a house. Oh my god. These things are getting filled up like crazy. I think I may need to build up some more warehouses. Um, so you know what? Let's just build ourselves some more warehouses. Let's get one warehouse. Actually, hold up. Can we maybe get a warehouse right here somewhere? Just like this. I mean, I could, but I don't have money. I'm lacking a lot of money here. Wow, seriously? Okay, we're doing pretty bad on money. The thing is, we got some more houses moving in here, which is really great. Um, let's see if we can assign some people to work on these markets. 
Right, we got one there. And unfortunately, we need two more in order to assign here. Uh, let's look at our people for a second. Right in here. Woodcutter. Can't find a place to work. Well, in that case, you are not going to be a woodcutter anymore. You are going to be a... Uh, baker, Miller, Farmer, Tailor, Weaver, Shepherd, Forcer, Scholar, Stonemason. Hmm. I mean, I can make this guy a fisherman. And also... Assign it to work right here. Hmm, we cannot. What? But why? Why is that a thing? So, this guy is a woodcutter. He cannot find a place to work. Scholar? No. What about a farmer? I don't know why. Baker, maybe? <laughs> okay, so we got Victoria that's working here. That is great. We don't need to worry about that anymore. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Let's make him a stonemason then. Or competitor. Or a competitor. Never mind. We got so many people that don't have a job or at least they cannot work anywhere. This guy is a woodcutter, but he cannot work anywhere, anywhere. What about a forger? Do we need forgers? I mean, fishermen we already have. What about a miller? Let's see. Okay, so that's gonna be good. He already got a job in there. Uh, the scholar is gonna be a... Stone cutter. Let's see. Do we need any of those? No. Transporter? Hopefully we need some of those. Let's get a ma another market tender. Uh, let's get another market tender in here and another market tender in here. And I think that's about it. Hopefully. Okay, so this carpenter doesn't have a job. Let's make a builder. Let's make this guy a transporter. Another transporter. And I think we're good. Everybody has a job now. Alright, perfect. So we are good on that side. Uh, the church is still working. Once again, unfortunately, we do not have a priest. And I have no idea how to get a priest. I would love it if you guys would let me know how to freaking get a priest. Although I see that people are starting to get some faith in. Look at that. I just don't know how to figure out to get uh, myself a priest, though. That is the only thing I need to figure out. Stone extensions. Stone extension B. I mean, I guess I could create an extension here, like a house for the priest. So let's get that going. And let's also put an entrance for this thing. Or can we? Huh. Doesn't like we can connect an entrance to that, which is weird. Yeah, it's really weird that you cannot put a an entrance to this thing. Huh. I'm guessing this needs to be connected to the church in order to work. I thought I would create an external house for the priest. Maybe I could put the house inside the... Oh no, it needs to be closed, never mind. Alright, what if I put this here? And add a door to it. No, I cannot really create a door. Well, I'm not gonna do it then. Whatever. I am not gonna do that then. I think we got enough extensions and stuff like that. I also hear a horse, so let's try to grab that mission. Hopefully we can get some more points. I will also need to assign some people in here as well. Start farming. And mark this area up. So let's see, let's mark this up just like this, just for here. Perfect, that is done. Alright, buddy, let's also grab a mission. Let's see, what does he need? He needs 20 fish. Uh, let's go with our people. Deliver. Perfect. 
And did we get some more points? Yes, we did. We now have 16. Look at that. We're really close to 20. Uh, I'm not gonna promote anybody. We are not doing good on money, unfortunately, so I'm not gonna do that. Alright, so hopefully we can get some more stuff unlocked in here. Maybe bring in some taverns, stuff like that. Get people to be happy and uh, decide to move in. Um, let's also assign... No. Okay, let's paint up the crops in here then. Get this ready for... Some more farming. Just like this. Perfect. And let's also remove one of these guys from here. And add it in here instead. Alright. There we go. This is looking lovely. We are definitely progressing. I mean, we're not doing really good on money, but... We're trying. We're doing the best we can here. And I also see that people are starting to move in certain areas. Uh, let's see. We cannot assign any forges in here, unfortunately. Although we have marked this for extraction. So once we got some more people, I am going to put them here. Uh, let's add berries in these two. Actually, let's just add berries in here. And we got some transporters moving in this one, which is perfect. Actually, you know what? I think I may need to remove two transporters from this one. And assign those transporters to be... something else instead. So let's see, one of the transporters that doesn't have a job. Do we have any? Maybe I should make these guys foragers. Uh, this transporter may come a forager as well. Alright, so unfortunately nobody decided to come here. I'm not sure why. Oh, there we go. So we got one in there and we got one in here. There we go. Hopefully they will do their job and move the berries inside this freaking granary. Alright, so we got that going. Uh, I think I'm actually going to build up a bridge in here. Since I just don't know what else to build. <laughs> Wooden bridge. Let's go with this bad boy. Uh, where do I need you? I need you to come right over there. This is way too big, actually. Hold up. I think I need you right there, yeah. And this one, make it a little bit shorter. Just like that. So construction. Alright, perfect. Hopefully this is going to be really good. Uh, what else? I think I'm gonna also make a bridge right here. Why the heck not? So let's see, let's do that. Uh, decorative, wooden gates, wooden bridge. Alright, so let's make this bridge start over here. And go all the way to here. Um... Let's try to make it a little bit shorter, actually. Maybe just like that. Let's see. I mean, that's a lot of waste. It's a lot of waste still. Alright, there we go. I think that's gonna be right. So we got that going. Hopefully we can finish that bridge up. Oh, people are still visiting churches, which is really, really great. I may need to put... Hold up, I may need to put a granary right in here. Or actually, I don't think I can store wool in the granaries. Let's just test it out. No, you cannot store wool in the granaries. So in this case, I may need to build up a... A warehouse in here. So that we can start storing up some of the wool. Let's see, let's place this one. Just like this. Hopefully that's going to help up a little bit. Um, Alright, this guy is still not uh, selling that freaking stuff. And I, I just don't know why we're not selling the clothing. I just don't get it. I really, really don't get it. But um, yeah, anyway. Currently we're getting money. I mean, I'm not really getting that much money. It's crazy how much uh, how much we're spending and how little we're actually producing. 
I just don't know how to freaking start producing more money. I just don't know what to do. Alright, so let's see. Are my people started selling stuff in here? So we have 45 berries, 25 fish, 50 breads. Nothing reserved though. Nobody's buying through here. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Someone just came in and bought something. That is not bad. What? They already built up that bridge? Seriously? Hold up, hold up. Where's that bridge? Wow, look at these freaking clusters of berries. That's crazy how many there are in here. <laughs> if you have this, that area unlocked, you definitely don't need some anything else anymore. Alright, look at that. They actually built up this bridge, which looks really lovely. And I think people are... Not using it. <laughs> what the heck? Did I just messed up this one? I should have. Let's see. Are they gonna use it or not? They are not using it. Wow, that was a waste. Let's just destroy it. That was such a waste. But at least, uh, hopefully, they are, they will start using this one. Let's just see. Once they finish it. Come on, boys. Finish this thing up. I hope people are gonna start using this bridge at least. Alright, so we got this bridge going. Hopefully uh, they will start using it. Let's see. Please go on the bridge. Seriously. She's just gonna go around. Wow. Well, I guess I could start creating a fence or something here. Uh, using hedges, just like this. And hopefully they will start using that bridge, so let's just see. Oh, let's actually move this one up here just like that. And I think they will actually start using the bridge now. <laughs> I am forcing them to do what I want them to do, because they just don't want to listen. These freaking minions don't want to listen to me. There we go, I think they're using it now. Alright, perfect. Uh, what else? I mean, I definitely have enough money to buy another piece of the land. I could go on and buy this one. We have a lot of rock in here. Just don't know if I want that. I may actually need to buy this one instead, so let's just go with that. You might be wondering why I decided to buy this land. Well, the thing is, I may need to create some more fishing areas on this side. And also... I don't know, decide on doing some more stuff as well. Uh, we don't have any more money here anymore, so... Let's see... Yeah, we definitely don't have any more money here in order to start building up some more stuff. But I am gonna try to chop out all these trees here. Um, so in order to do that... Oh! Abandon this territory! No! Cancel! Holy crap, I don't want to do that. Let's exit from there. And instead, let's go with a... Lumber camp. Right in the middle of this forest. Hopefully we can get rid of this forest here. Alright, well, uh, we're definitely uh, improving here. I mean, we're really slow on improving. We're working really hard on... Managing to do some stuff, managing to get some more money in. But um, I may need to start creating some more stuff that we can sell. I mean, that's the only that's the only way we can start producing money. I see that we got a lot of planks, we got a lot of clothing. But unfortunately, we're not really trading it as fast. I just don't know what to do here in order to get more money. Um, yeah. I mean, I could definitely try to get to, to try to sell some more stuff through here by selecting, I don't know, 200 on this one, or maybe 150. Uh, try to sell 150 more with the planks as well so that we can get us some more money. But I don't know, my markets don't seem to work that well. Uh, stone, also, we could sell about 200 of this because we have a lot. Let's see, so this is sell ab all above the value. Sell all above the value. 
Yeah, I don't know. We are uh, we are definitely really struggling. But you know what, guys? We are definitely going to have to end up the episode right here for now. And if you guys have some good tips and tricks that you would be able to share with me, I would definitely much appreciate that. As uh, we are working really hard here, trying to figure out a way to, I don't know, grow our city some more, unlock some more stuff, and uh, be able to build up a, a more powerful kingdom for Constantinople. Anyway, guys, as usual, Thank you all very much for watching the video so far. Of course, if you enjoyed this and you want to see more, a like would be much appreciated. And if you guys are new here and have subscribed yet, please consider doing that as I'm posting videos just like this one every single day, playing many more in the adventure games, puzzle games, and even city builder games. Alright, I'll see you all in the next one real soon. Bye!